Hi, Dave Kanicki here with the Farm Equipment Editor's Blog for December 14th, 2010. I'll be the first to admit that amid all of the hubbub going on with the transition to Tier 4 interim engines, I didn't think about a longer term issue that involves new equipment. Namely, what's going to happen with this equipment when farmers are ready to trade it in? Deere and Company's management broached the subject during its analyst meeting last week in New York. It pointed out that they anticipate a problem in the, in the used equipment post-2011 will not be as easy to export as most countries do not have access to ultra-low sulfur diesel fuels needed for the Tier 4 engines to operate properly. For several years, dealers have found ready export markets for many of their large used machinery in Eastern Europe, Russia, Ukraine, South America, and even Mexico. Unfortunately, not many of these countries have adopted the Tier 4 type emission standards, so they don't need the ultra-clean fuel required by the U.S. and E.U. countries. According to the Diesel Technology Forum, a non-profit organization that focuses on diesel engines, fuel, and technology, the new ultra-clean fuel is extremely important because sulfur causes problems with exhaust control devices and diesel engines. It's very similar to lead, which once impeded the catalytic converters on gasoline cars. We've checked with a couple of dealers who have been exporting used farm equipment during the last decade or so, but we haven't heard back from them. I suppose this situation could be categorized under the law of unintended consequences. In any case, it's something that will need to be studied. If you have any thoughts on it, please pass them along. We'd like to hear from you. Thanks. Hope you have a nice Christmas and a great New Year's. Talk to you next time.